The goal was to simply take some trails near the ocean, heading north, climb Serra da Pesqueria, then back down to Samartin and finally check Salir do Porto on the other side of the bay. Samartin is a very charming village with a natural bay reminding the shape of a shell. In the past, ships were built in these quiet waters and the aristocracy started to come here to enjoy the summer holidays, including our last king, Carlos I. The region has a long fault that basically separates the limestone layers by the coast and the alluvial deposits and sands inland. I wrote this in January, so it was very quiet, but you can imagine how busy it can become during summer. Okay. I was, I'm walking this uh, European uh, hike path uh -huh. called E9. E9. But it's yeah, it's very diverse, right? The, our coastline has a, a, a little bit of everything. And you've been uh, walking from where? So I've been in uh, Lisbon for a few days. See you in another day. <laughs> Ciao. On the south shore of the bay, we have Salir do Porto, with wooden walkways and a huge sand dune. It is considered to be the biggest dune in Portugal, and it was in this village that several ships were built during the age of discovery. 